right, welcome back to the channel. Now we've got another 11 plus question. Let's have a quick read. We've got 14 lampposts that are spaced evenly along a road. The distance from the first to the sixth is 80 meters, and we've got to find how far it is from the first to the 14th lamppost. So with this kind of question, you probably want to draw as much as you can uh, so you can see it presented in front of you. So the distance from the first to the sixth lamppost. Maybe we should draw out six lampposts. So let's just say that line represents a lamppost. That's the first one. That's the second one. That's the third one. There's the fourth. There's the fifth. And there's the sixth. So there's my six lampposts. And what we're told is the distance from the first to the sixth all of that distance there is 80 meters. So what can we do with this information? Well, we know that there are gaps between each of these lampposts. But what we've got to pick up on is that although there are six lampposts, there are not six gaps. So if you count on the gaps carefully, you've got one, two, three, four, only five gaps. So this 80 meters has five gaps. So I can write something like this. And then what we can do from there is find the distance of one gap because they're spaced evenly. So to find the distance for one gap, I would need to divide this by five, divide this by five, so one gap. And 80 divided by five, that's gonna give me 16 meters. So each of those little gaps in there are 16 meters. So we can fill this in. We can do 16 meters here, another 16, another 16, another 16, and another 16. And so our job here was to find the total distance between the first and the 14th lamppost. Now, as we saw between the first and the sixth lamppost, there were only five gaps. So between the first and the 14th lamppost, there will be a total of 13 gaps. And if you want to see that, you can actually draw out 14 lampposts and count the gaps between them and you'll see that there are 13 gaps in total. Now we learned that one gap is 16 meters and in total there are 13 gaps. So to work out the total distance, all we'll need to do is 13 and times that by 16. So that's going to be uh, 160 plus 48. So I think that's going to be 208 meters in total. And that's our total distance.